Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. We are, well, I am, but you are. That's profound. No, I'm kidding, I don't know what I'm saying. But today's video is to discuss the sixth book that I read in 2015. And that book was A Gathering of Old Men by Ernest J. Gaines. The premise of the book is set in the Louisiana sugarcane plantation. In 1970, a gathering of old men is a powerful depiction of racial tension arising over the death of a Cajun farmer at the hands of a black man. So you really get to see what racial tension was really like in those times. And for those of us who, who were not around, it's, it's a really eye-opening depiction. And the way Ernest uh, Gaines writes the book, you get to see the tension and you get to view the tension from different characters and their perspective on the tension, and their perspective on race. And it's a really, really, really good book. Uh, it kind of gave me an understanding of how far we came and in some aspects, how far we still need to go as a society and especially as, we, as it relates to race. It kind of ended kind of differently than I expected because you kind of throughout the book you have this whole standoff between all these old uh, uh, farmers and the white law and the white uh, establishment. So you kind of have this standoff between the different factions, and it builds up, it builds up, it builds up, and you get to you get to view it from different farmers perspective you get to view it from the sheriff's perspective you get to view it from the the, the Cajun farmer's father you know the white the white father and, and the, the decision and the thought process is going through his head and his brothers and and the other people that are ready to 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 get it going to a war with these uh, black farmers over the death of a white Cajun farmer so it really builds a lot of tension but when it ended it ended kind of you know, I didn't think it was going to end the way it ended. I won't give it away for those of you who want to read it, but it's it's really a good read, a quick read. You can read it in, in one weekend. It's, it's a page turner. Check it out at your local library, purchase on Amazon or, or wherever you uh, purchase your books. And you won't regret it. Join me tomorrow where I'll be going over the seventh book and we'll finally be caught up in all the books. If you watched all my videos up to this point, we'll finally be caught up and from from to tomorrow's video on, I'll be uploading a video every Sunday, letting you know what I read and what I thought about it. I really thank you guys for, for sticking with me and holding me accountable. I would love to get your comments. I would love to get your feedback. If you're doing a challenge, a reading challenge, let me know about it. I would love to, to, to comment on your videos to help you guys out and, and maybe glean some things from you that I can read and maybe we can share it. It'd be a wonderful experience. Thank you guys again. I always appreciate those that watch. And we'll see you on the next video. Peace.